not just going through, but growing through the narrow spots of life. I had a soft, non-painful lump on the inside of my left wrist that I ignored for about seven weeks, hoping that it would go away. An MRI revealed a six inch mass beginning in my hand, filling my wrist and extending into my forearm. In March of that year, Dr. Dennis Closey, an orthopedic surgeon at the Masonic Cancer Center, University of Minnesota, performed a biopsy and gave me my diagnosis of very high grade, malignant fibrous histiocytoma, the most common form of soft tissue sarcoma, a very uncommon form of cancer. I asked Dr. Cloacy what would happen if I did not accept amputation. And he encouraged me to accept, to choose life without my left hand. Every day I am confronted with something that is two-handed. And every day I'm given the opportunity to learn to do that thing a new way, to ask for help, or to decide gracefully never to do that thing again. The fear that the cancer will return is always there but it is a gift to remind me to live every day authentically. I am so happy to be um, alive that it amazes me how often I have to stop and say to myself, ah, that's a two-handed thing.